I'm not sure about this angle. Can I see my feet? <laughs> but, I don't know. Hi. Hello, everybody. How are you? It's Saturday morning, so you can't even see me now. If I do it like that. So I need to be low like this. It's Saturday morning. Good morning. How are you? Um, yeah, I thought I would try and vlog today and see if I can keep vlogging through the day because what I usually do is start vlogging in the morning get really motivated and then kind of lose motivation throughout the day and forget to turn on my camera so today i'm gonna go see my cousin who lives outside the city so i need to take tram to go to the station and then take a train and then take another train and then walk a little bit to go to her place and we're gonna hang out and it's gonna be really cool so i hope i can motivate myself to film throughout the day because i think it's gonna be a fun day the weather is a little cooler than yesterday yesterday it was like 27 degrees celsius can you believe this temperature for april i mean i'm a little afraid that this may be our summer and then during the summertime it's going to be gray and raining because it has happened before oh sun in my eyes the pattern is pretty though on my face yeah no Also, really sad news. Yesterday, Avicii died at the age of 28. I mean, his age doesn't really matter, but 28 is so young for such a talented musician, DJ. And oh my goodness, it's just, it's so sad. I was really shocked to, to read about it and it's such a shame. Death is always sad for the people who stay, for the friends, for the family and in this case for the people who loved him, who didn't know him but who appreciated his music. So I've been listening to Avicii all morning and it just it takes me back to my art school years where I used to do my school um, art school assignments listening to the radio and at that time uh, Levels was playing all the time so it really does bring back memories and my thoughts are with his friends and family because it, it really cannot be easy. <sighs> yeah, I don't even know what else to say about that. Anyway, um, I just, I think the laundry is almost finished. I want to put the laundry to dry before I leave. I need to take the trains for the time. What did I just say? The times for the trains and oh, oh my goodness. Oh, I need to give my cat some fresh water. Yeah, and then, oh my god, this is, I'm like, working my abs right now. <laughs> and then I need to um, get ready. I am kind of ready, but yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Let's go.
Tchau! Okay, this is the walk to the stay from the station. For all you OG seedlings out there who have seen my really old vlogs, you've seen me walk this path, get lost, find my way, arrive. <laughs> but yeah, for those who don't know where I am, this place is called Louvain-la-Neuve, just outside of Otigny, which is a student town so all you see here are probably 90% like student houses so the one of the main universities here in Belgium in Louvain-la-Neuve so yeah I think I'm going in the right direction I think from where I was it was just straight 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 and then almost there I'm hoping <laughs> Otherwise, it will just be a typical Iku gets lost episode. It always happens that way. Okay, that guy just, just stopped, stopped dead in his tracks when he saw me arrive. I think he's confused. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's this way. <laughs> okay, anyway, it's a small student's city with one of the main universities and uh, yeah nothing else to say I'm gonna try and find my way now even though I'm pretty sure this is it crap am I sure am I sure okay see you in a minute yay we just got some beers <laughs> Duh. Duh. Flash Saturday. Flash camera. <laughs> Most of my viewers are from Japan, so we can teach them something today. Oh yeah, flash camera. I even have no clue what if that could be. If you came to them, you try this. This is the Belgian concept. <laughs> <laughs> You're teaching them bad, bad things. <laughs> this is what I like about Louvain and Nerve is because you have all these little streets where you can get lost, and it's always so pretty and cute. I'm, not, I'm really not convinced this is gonna be any good. <laughs> okay, so today we're going to make a beer cocktail. <laughs> This is very super simple. <laughs> so <the face> is <laughs> this is carapis, a very good beer. No, 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 you, you can't say that. <laughs> Okay. What is Carapils exactly? Please explain. So yeah, it's like the really really cheap beer you can find. The cheapest beer you can find in Belgium, <laughs> like one of the cheapest. The so it's beer. the beer of the homeless people, <laughs> the beer of the students that are broke, like cheap beer. But as it is Belgian, it is still good. <laughs> so we are trying something. I mean, I've never tried it. You've never tried it. I thought this was your secret recipe. But <laughs> I've tried it with some other beer, okay. but not with Cara. I think you're gonna kill my stomach. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's not. It's not strong. No, so. like that, mm -hmm. Yeah, normally it's, it, it works with garden, and we called it a flash garden. Okay. So. Yeah, because this is called flash. Flash. Yeah. <laughs> so this what is, is a this flash Cara. Exactly? <laughs> oh, this is vodka. Mm. Okay, I thought this was like a mixer, but it's not. No, it's alcoholic. Yeah. I'm, I'm trying to make it so like everybody has the same <laughs> amount of beer and the same amount of delicious beer. <laughs> so, 
So I'm for the... <laughs> That's the taser. <laughs> Or... You see, it's like a creek. <laughs> <laughs> a creek is actually a good beer. <laughs> she wanted some Ugandan rose, so mm -hmm. I'm just trying to please her. Guys, we're speaking very Belgian right now, but <laughs> understand their Belgian beers. Yeah, casual drop. That's how we speak here. Yeah, I guess the color is pretty nice. I want to try it. <laughs> You look delicious, actually. <laughs> Will you do me the favor, Zoe? <laughs> the honor. <laughs> it's quite good, uh -huh. actually. Yeah. Don't say that. <laughs> you need to try it now. Yeah. <laughs> but I knew it would be good. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try it too. It's okay. It's, it's good. good. It's good. It's good. <laughs> See? See? I don't you like can trust me when it's about beer. <laughs> okay, time to go eat. So if you didn't know, my cousin Zoe is a chef Yay. and I kind of suck at finding recipes to do for lunch every day. I kind of get bored. I always do the same thing. So right now we got all her books, well, her best books. Yeah, not all of them <laughs> because we take all the library yeah. with us. <laughs> so she's been recommending me some cool recipes that I can try with some not too expensive like flavors, like using garlic and onions. I'd never thought about it, but it's super simple and super cheap. Yeah, it's the basic. And garlic is like super healthy for your health. So, mm. so what she recommended is I use like a cereal or what was it? A bean also? A cereal, uh, or cereal a bean? bean or a potato, yeah, or potato rice or something like that. Yeah for the base mm -hmm. and after you can add some vegetables yeah seasonal vegetables seasonal and yeah just put some that some nuts because oh yeah nuts I, it's I had the forget. crispy yeah the, the texture everybody the forget but it's super nice to have like the sour taste <laughs> the crispy taste yeah. sugary a little bit with like mm. risen or like some. dried fruit yeah, yeah. Mm. or it, fresh fruit or fresh fruit yeah that for sure like strawberry in, Strawberry? In yeah, you can do like a tabule with strawberry. It's like, Seriously? Mm. Mm, that actually sounds really Strawber good. Strawberry and asparagus. Yummy! <laughs> yeah, and if you've been following me for a while, you know that I go to the farmer's market like every other week where you can just buy all the seasonal vegetables and all the, the cereal and the grains, like you buy them without all the wrapping and everything. So, great ideas. And I think I'm gonna try that, so you might see that with me. Oh yeah. In the I, next few weeks. I can't wait to see yeah. it. Okay, I just had to change the battery. So we drinking some water. Yeah. Um, I don't remember what I was saying. Oh yeah, I was thinking that I might try some recipes with Zoe one day if you guys are interested in... Selling in the panel. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> what? I toujours pas compris ce que tu voulais. Mais le dire en commentaire. Tell, oh, tell, yeah. in the below. tell me, let me know down below or leave a comment. I think, that, I think that's what she was trying to say. Yay. <laughs> Confused. Yeah. yeah, let me know if there are recipes you want to uh, try. Maybe some like typical Belgian recipes but made like healthy or something. That could be interesting because I know you guys, most of you guys don't come from Belgium. French fries. <laughs> French fries. Belgian fries, dude. No more French. <laughs> yeah, but... Yeah. Because right now, so far I've showed you one typically Belgian thing in this vlog and it was a flash... What was it? Flash <laughs> carrot. Yeah, flash carrot. A Belgian cara. cocktail. Belgian cocktail. Beer cocktail. Beer cocktail. I've never had a beer cocktail before. If you want to know more, we can do another Yeah, thing. maybe we could do some crazy Belgian recipes, not necessarily healthy, I mean. Like beer like and fun. cola. Beer and cola. What was that thing our aunt used to drink that was really weird 
It was beer and cola. Is it that that's why beer you mean? Beer and coke. Yeah, beer it's called uh, mazout. Yeah. You have the tango. It's with uh, um, grenadine. Uh, beer and grenadine. Like, it's kind of a syrup. I don't know how you say grenadine in English. I'll have to insert it here fruit later. Syrup. It's this one is good. The fruit syrup one is good, but I've never had a mazout. Oh, it looks disgusting. It looks gross, but it's it look. It looks like gasoline because that, the name is magic. Yeah. yeah, it does look like tar. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, I'm gonna enjoy the sun now. Yeah. Hey guys, it's the next day. I didn't end. So oh, this is not put in properly. I didn't end yesterday's video. Uh, we ended up staying at the park a little longer, staying in the sun, chatting, just chilling between us and. Um, yeah, afterwards we, it was getting a little late, so I went back home and I didn't film my ride back home, I was kind of exhausted. And when I got home I just kind of crashed, watched movies and stuff. So yeah, this is the next day and I know I look a mess. I'm in my old green day t-shirt and I've got the sun in my face, so yeah. <laughs> I'm about to oil my hair and um, I wanted to end the vlog properly while I oil my hair. I don't know why I thought this would be a good idea. <laughs> but yeah, I never... It's been a long time since I vlogged, so it was a good uh, little refresher. So today I'm going to be studying, doing laundry... What else? What else? What else? Maybe I'll try editing this vlog, though I feel that I might need a chilled day at home. Chilled since I'm going to be studying. So that's enough of my rambling, I'm gonna finish oiling my hair um, and then I'm gonna put in a load, load of laundry but thank you for watching this vlog I don't know if I'm gonna continue it but see you whenever I see you with my oily squinty face Ugh. Happy Easter! I'm eating a bunny <laughs> Yeah, I'm putting it everywhere but it's so good, I don't care. <laughs>